We got this character in tournament. I don't know if he's been playing him the rest of the day, but and then also Asprey on Donkey Kong. So this is kind of a uh, kind of interesting. I know that uh, Asprey was telling me that he was playing Donkey Kong against Vault because like. He'd rather deal with like all that instead of like Incineroar into Belmont. And he ended up winning 2-0, so like I mean he knows what he's talking about. And he's obviously very confident in the Donkey Kong, as this was his former Smash 4 main. And you know, Asprey obviously not skipping a beat because uh, that's just the kind of player he is. But Croy is going to be taking the first stock. And, uh, yeah. Good job, Croix. I think you're just... Oh, I, no, I, I was going to say, I think you're just dead, but that is not how I thought you would die. <laughs> All right. So, two socks apiece. You know, good old juggles situation going on. You know what? Uh, people are like, oh, PS2. Yeah, this is a totally equal balance stage. This stage is actually really good for Donkey Kong. Wow, he got caught by that. Good switch. Now, this is a really good stage for Donkey Kong. Primarily because, one, it's big. So, like, DK's survivability gets exacerbated uh, on this kind of stage. Two, those platforms lead to some very early kill setups. Whether between, like, tech chases and, you know, clapping him with the up smash. Or, you know, it lets him relive his ding-dong days. And, uh, yeah, it's pretty good. So. All right, this is uh, this, this is a stressful situation for both players. I feel uh, both of these. I would I would say like you know, Donkey Kong is probably going to be living for a little while. But you also got to remember it's Pyra. Yeah, that is you can't do that. You can't you can't be doing that. But uh. Yeah, like I, like I was saying, though, Pyra has a way about her to kind of, like, make you explode, so. Even if, even if you're, like, very, very heavy, Py Pyra does not care. And then Mithra, of course, has the ability to rush down, kind of oppress, distress, and everything in between. Alright, 8.8% gets punished because Donkey Kong, for some reason, feels like he has to pose at the end of his upbeat. Oh, that, that's a shield break? Is it? Oh, no. That was definitely a forward smash, but... Yeah, I think if he just did a neutral B instead, then, uh... Yeah, that, that could have been the game. But, you know what? It's still even. Still doable. Oh my god, that angle. That's so gross against a character. Alright. Asprey clutching it up. You know, saying, I don't need the shield break. Although, you know, to be fair, if he, you know, if he did kill off the shield break, that probably would have been less stressful for him, so. But, you know what? It happens. All right, going into game number two. We are going to be seeing the Ridley. Croy pulling out his entire arsenal. Well, some of his ar arsenal for this heated match. Battle between two titans. Two very big characters. Yet, incidentally, 
Just because Ridley is like bony and all scrunched up, he actually looks like smaller than DK, even though realistically, obviously, haha, Ridley's too big. We all know that. But, um. Oh! That up smash, not gonna do it. That. I don't know how he avoided that, to be honest. Now, yeah, ill advised up B, but, you know, he's gonna live it. Is he dead? And Donkey Kong is living. Wow, I do not understand fully what it's like to be privileged enough to uh, live as long as a heavy, apparently. Wow, this is actually going a lot like last game. Because in the first stock, Croy was actually up in percent by a substantial amount. So I don't I don't think Asprey's sweating too much. I think he's, you know, I, mentally I think he's doing okay. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> that that could have been a very cheesy stock as the smash jargon goes. Yeah, that back air kick in the face, that is going to do it. Interesting B reverse. Uh, maybe to just like escape like mix them up. Interesting to use his jump there, but it doesn't get caught. Croy definitely could have killed him around that jump, because, like, yeah, that, that, that was a stressful situation. Here's the thing. Asprey has his, uh, Asprey has his giant punch. So Ridley could just... Oh! My god! Morty! Nope. Yeah, it, it's very hard to punish that. Uh, you're, even if you have a disjoint, it's... Just, Ridley's just joined his big too. He did the he did the elite smash Donkey Kong. You know, just just fucking go for it. Okay. Is that gonna do it? No, that's not gonna do it. Donkey Kong's got a little too much weight in his cheeks, if you know if you know what I mean. Yeah, that was actually a really good angle. That's gonna kill though. Donkey Kong can't make it back from that. Yeah, I noticed Croy likes to go for those once, um, you know, once once he's in that spot where he doesn't have as much to lose, he's okay with dying there in that exchange. All right, so it is a uh, one-one. So we're basically playing best of three all over again. All right, back to PS2. There is no DSR on the table here. If you're unaware, we have uh, eight stages and you get three bands. I could have swore it was nine stages. Oh wait, it is nine stages. No, it is eight. I don't know, I'm an idiot. Oh no. Okay, okay. Um, yeah, I could have swore we had Yoshi's at some point because I definitely had to ban that up against Raziak a few times. Are you, you're, you're, you, wow, you didn't get hit by that? Yeah, that's gonna kill. Good catch from Croy. You know, taking a little bit of a lead. You need to stay away from the ledge there. You need to stop getting hit by that. Just, just let him run off stage, you know, just. If, if he wants to hang out there, oh, well, actually, you know what? I forgot who I was talking about, apparently. <laughs> Because Asprey is not that kind of player. He's, uh... Yeah, he, he capitalizes off those hard. So we're back to one stock apiece. Uh, Asprey kind of getting schmixed, jiggled a little bit. Is he alive? No. Now that F smash is going to take it. All right, we're going back to PS2. All right. Back we go. Oh, he went for the skewer, but, you know, didn't pan out because uh, it's a bit of a hard move to hit, admittedly.
geführt. Oh, that was a really good parry. Oh, that's, yeah, that's, that's a very strong F smash. That is definitely going to take it. He got hit by back air from in front, but okay. Yeah, Croy just trying to end that. Wow, he is not letting up his pressure. Yeah, this is looking a little... Okay, that F smash is going to take it. Don't do it. Oh, he did it. Yeah. And that is going to be the set.